Dark Avatar Optimizer by Dark Player. Optimize, optimize, optimize. We are on a never ending quest to optimize our avatars within VR chat. Dark Avatar Optimizer for years has played a pivotal role in helping those who wish to simplify this process. A friend of mine, Miss Jets, has brought to my attention that I need to uh, highlight the importance of this tool and why it's so crucial to have it in your day to day Unity projects. What this Unity tool does is that it creates a checklist for you to, you know, identify and eliminate unnecessary blend shapes mesh renders, material slots, and so, so much more. Many of you might already have this, but for those of you that don't, this could be the miracle that you need to optimize your avatars. This tool is found on Dark Player or Dark Coder's GitHub page, and it is absolutely free. You do not have to pay a dime for this. If you're curious to learn more about this, AkiWu actually has a uh, great section on one of her YouTube videos explaining what this does in more detail if you want to give her video a watch. I am joined uh, actually right now by my friend, Miss Jetst, that will explain how to install this properly onto Unity, if you would please. So, step one, just make sure you're using the VRChat Creator Companion, or VCC for short. Step two, go over, to, go over to Google and search for Dark Avatar Optimizer. It will be the first result with a GitHub page. Step three, scroll down to installation and press the click here button. Browser will then ask you if you want to open VCC press open when prompted to. Step four, VCC should then open with the add repository page. This camera will pop up about community projects, but you can just press I understand add repository. Step five, you can now browse over to your projects and press manage product on the project you want to add it to. Step six, click on your model and go over to the inspector tab and scroll down to add component and search for D4RK. Click it and it should just be there. Step seven, make sure optimize on upload is checked and you're good to go. Most of the time this will just work, but there will be a few edge cases where this will break. So if you haven't noticed by now, this is the Steam VR background world. This is what you first see when you log into Steam VR is this background, right? But there's also something else over here that I want to show you guys, something that might look a little familiar to you. Is, uh, does this look familiar to you? Is there a certain virtual Spartan that this uh, this set makes you think of? Hmm? I can think of one. 